Well, radar and satellite picture. We do have snow showers rolling across the area. These are some of those lake effect snow showers wrapping up our Thanksgiving with some of the wintry type of weather. Some of those snow showers a little steadier toward our lakeshore communities out there toward Fremont into Woodville over toward uh, Port Clinton, Sandusky up through the Lake Erie Islands. As this cooler air begins to rush into the area. Light flurries across Sylvania back toward Toledo down toward Perrysburg. It's a little bit steadier down into central Wood County right around Bowling Green where it could be cold enough now that this uh, sticking snow, so to speak, could uh, result in some slippery spots on the roadways. We're very close to the freezing mark and it will get colder tonight, so anything that does fall will have the chance of sticking and becoming a little slippery into tomorrow morning. Some additional snow showers on a cold, brisk start to our Friday morning. You could count on it being in the upper 20s, but wind chills much of the day in the upper teens and lower uh, lower 20s. It is going to be a cold afternoon, some occasional snow showers. And again, there's going to be drifting more so southern Michigan into extreme northern Ohio. Minor accumulations will be possible with winds gusting up to about 30 miles per hour. And into fr uh, Saturday, it is going to stay downright cold into the weekend ahead. Now, how much snow are we looking at? It's not going to be much less than an inch for most of the area. Could get one to two inches across southern Michigan. That's Hillsdale, Lenaway, and Monroe County. For much of northwest Ohio, it's a half an inch or less, including the Toledo Metro down into Wood. Wood County where the broader bigger snows are going to be heavy lake effect snow is really going to be kicking eastern Ohio. We're looking over toward Lake and Ashtabula counties. They're under lake effect snow warnings where I think by the end of the weekend they could get two to three feet of snow. So I want you to be extra cautious if you're traveling east of Cleveland. There's going to be some very treacherous lake effect snow that will be unfolding this weekend. For us though, it's the cold weather the feels like it's going to be in the teens much of the afternoon on Saturday and keep that in mind for the big game Michigan at Ohio State kickoff time right around the upper 20s near 30 toward the end of the game, but wind chill factors are going to be quite a bit colder tonight. Some scattered snow showers cold and breezy down to 27. We're going to be well below freezing. We'll be at the freezing mark for highs on Friday. Some scattered snow showers, minor light accumulations. And as we get to Saturday, we're going to have highs close to 30 degrees, low 30s into the weekend, and we'll stay in the 30s. Much of that 10 day forecast with the cold feel set to continue.